Well, tonight we are answering some of your questions about the coronavirus vaccine. Dr. Malika Marshall joins us now live. Always nice to see you, doctor. Let's start with Linda's question. She writes in, I am getting my first COVID shot this Saturday and then again, of course, in 28 days. Will I be able to see my grandchildren two weeks after that last vaccine? Good question. That is a good question, and Linda, it's a question that a lot of people are asking and want to know the answer to. I mean, it's true that a couple of weeks after you get your second dose, you're going to be much less likely to get really sick from COVID-19, but we still don't know if you could potentially still get infected, not get sick, but pass the virus on to others, including possibly your grandchildren. And it's true that you will have up to 95% protection from COVID-19, but it's not 100%. So you need to know that if you do get together with family members, there still is a risk. If you do decide to do that, just make sure everybody wears a mask and you try to keep as much distance as you can between people. So many of our questions are from grandparents who are just dying to hug their grandkids. No question about that. Uh, both Katie and Gary in East Falmouth want to know if you get the Moderna vaccine for the first shot, can you then get the Pfizer vaccine for the second shot? So the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines actually use similar MRA mRNA technology, but they are slightly different. One is given four weeks apart, one is given three weeks apart. So you should stick with the first one you get. So if you get Moderna for the first vaccine, first shot, you should stick with Moderna for the second. And All right, versa. good information there. And Phil asks, my wife and I are 72 years old and we'll get the first shot of the vaccine hopefully in February. We're scheduled to be away in North Carolina for the month of March. Is there a way to get that second shot while they're down in North Carolina? You know, I just don't have a great answer for you other than to say that it, at this point, it would probably be very difficult to coordinate. Um, some people are worried about even getting their second shot and coordinating that here in Massachusetts. So what I would do is call the Department of Public Health down in North Carolina to see if they might be able to give you some answers. Ooh, otherwise, that's a long drive back to get that second shot. Might still be worth it, though. Dr. Malika Marshall, <laughs> thank right. you so much. Always great to get your advice. And Dr. Pleasure. Malika offers her best advice, but as always, consult your personal doctor before making any decisions about your health. If you have a question for Dr. Malika, three ways to reach her. Her email is drmalika at cbs.com. On Twitter, her handle is at Malika Marshall. Or you can Facebook message her, Dr. Malika Marshall.